Chris, this time of the summer is usually a time where players' futures get decided. Your future has been decided and you'll be playing Premier League football this season. Yeah, obviously delighted about that. Um, so obviously pre-season has been going on a, a week or two now, but it's, it's still quite early. Um, so it gives me time to settle in and get to know everyone. I'm going to Portugal today, I'll certainly have a chance to, to get to know everyone, sing my song and, um, and yeah, you know, sort of settle in quickly. Looking around here at Medeski Stadium, it's fairly quiet now during the summer, but for yourself, last time you were here, I think there were 20,000 people on the pitch after the Reading game promotion against Forest, your old club, and you were just trying to get away and get into the dressing room. So I guess it's a very different feeling now, knowing that you'll be representing the roles. Yeah, it was um, obviously a great night for, for this club. Um, and, you know, sort of always had the sense, even during the game, that, that it was sort of the goal was coming. Um, and uh, no, certainly, certainly a bit quieter than when I was last year. Um, but, but obviously that night has, has played a part in obviously everything that's gone on in the summer and, and obviously delighted to be here and, and looking forward to being involved in, in sort of nights and occasions like that, you know, being a player now. Another new Reading player who was uh, there that night in the stands, I believe, was Gareth McCleary, someone, of course, who uh, you know well and are very close to, I believe. Yeah, no, we're good mates. Um, and yeah, he was, I think he was suspended for that game. And obviously he moved here in the summer and you know, that'll help me you know, settle in a little bit quicker and knowing that to be fair I know quite a lot of the lads um, you know, from Wales and stuff like that so hopefully now I can, it won't be too much of a, of a problem to settle in because um, certainly looking in it seems like a very really nice group of boys and um, you know, can, can obviously get away and and get to know them that little bit better you know, on pre-season tour. I know the manager, Brian McDermott, always likes to get to know players before he makes a decision to sign them. I'm sure that was the case with you, so did he play a big part in your decision to come to the basic state? Yeah, massive, probably one of the you know, the biggest the biggest factors in me joining the club, really. Um, you know, speaking to, to Hallam Church over the years with Wales, um, you know, and obviously you just talk about things that go on at your club, and, and the manager was always the main thing that you know, they always brought up, and, Having met him, you know when it was all going through, yeah, that was probably the biggest part. And, and knowing that I'm coming to a to a huge club um, that wanted me and one that you know I can develop as a player, and knowing I'll get that help to do that. I think it's almost a month of the day now that you'll be stepping out here against Stoke City on the opening day. What are your aims, not just in the run up to that game, but for the season as a whole? Um, well, I think first of all to try and to try and get into that team. Um, you know, there's obviously a lot of a lot of players here who who got this club. You know, obviously, to be to be into the Premiership. Um, so knowing I'm joining the squad, that you know, I need to first of all, you know, impress them, um, and then from then on, obviously, as a as a club, we need to, to obviously try and you know start well and, and get a good start to, to obviously a successful season, which would be you know, obviously staying in this league and you know obviously building for for many years to come. You know, for for seasons in the Premiership.